Good Friday morning to you. We're going to be looking at 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verses 10 through 13. Here where Paul is talking to us about trying to know the heart and the mind and the will of God. Verse 10, he begins by saying, But it was to us that God revealed these things by his Spirit, by his Spirit, his Holy Spirit. For his Spirit searches out everything and shows us God's deepest secrets. It is Spirit that seeks out the secret places in our own lives and also the secret wisdoms and the blessings that God has for each of you. And each of you, each person, will be able to ascertain the blessings differently because he's created you to be who you are. Then look at verse 11. No one can know a person's thought except that person's own spirit. We are the only individuals to whom we can answer and know ourselves. And no one can know God's thoughts except God's own spirit. Now listen to that. We can only know our spirit for ourselves. It can says, confess your sins one to another. Confess who you are. You've got to know your own brokenness to confess it. You've also got to know your own strengths to relish it and embrace it. And he who received God's spirit, not the world's spirit, so we can know the wonderful things God has freely given us. <coughs> Excuse me. Listen. The secret here is when the Holy Spirit comes upon you, he helps us to understand the secrets of God for you because he knows your heart. He already knows us. He knows our strengths, our weaknesses, our joys, our fears. But in these three verses from 10 through 12 and a half to 13, Paul is reminding the church at Corinth Know yourself so you can be honest with yourself, so you can be honest with God. You have to confess your own sins, your own brokenness, to know the will of God and to know his love. To know his forgiveness means that you also got to know your own brokenness. As you walk into this Friday with us, may we look at our brokenness, our sinfulness, as well as our successes and joys that we can be honest before God and he reveal those deeper secrets to us. Pray with me. Father, we walk together in this Friday. We realize deep inside who we really, really are. We confess our brokenness, our sins to you, that you would forgive us and bring us into full fruition of your joy. Thank you for accepting us the way we are and forgiving us for the sins and helping us to become who you want us to be. In the name of Jesus, our Lord, amen. Walk in this day and be joyful and be happy, knowing that you are forgiven and that you've been made whole because you are able to confess all of the brokenness inside of you so that you can become strong. For when we are weak, that's whenever God is strongest in our lives. God bless you. I'll see you Monday. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.